Don't fall. Okay. Hi guys, it's me, Kaylin. And I have the phone up in a weird setup. So if you fall, I'm sorry, my hair is really gross. I just, well, it's not like nappy, it's just kind of like I washed my hair yesterday, so now it's just kind of weird-ish. And I slept on it wet, so it might be like binned. <clears throat> you know what I'm talking about. We're doing an observancy test on this Kotex brand pad without wings. Um, now it has a cloth wrapper, like, this one isn't cloth, so it's really quiet, like, if you touch it. Like, plastic ones aren't very quiet, but maybe I'll do a video on that today. Um, now when you open it, it's different. Okay, where do you open it? It also might be hard to find where it opens at. Okay. See? It's not incredibly loud, I just thought it'd be a lot not loud. But like, I suppose if you're doing this, it wouldn't be as loud. Okay, and it, um... It's not attached to the cloth padding, or the cloth stuff around it. Um, okay, you open it, and it's like this. And it does not have wings. I thought it had wings when I bought it. Um, but it didn't. That's okay, I guess. Um, it's not that sticky. Like, there's not that much sticky space, like, you see where, it's like, different, that's mostly where the sticky is. There's one, two, three, four, five, six lines of sticky, and like, um, like an always pad, which is just like a lot of sticky. Um, the capture core is really cool, it absorbs like a normal pad, like, you know, normal E. And it's kind of soft here. This isn't that soft. But it's got a pretty capture core, so... Okay, I just had to make sure... Oh, is that... Uh, I haven't done one of these in a while, so now my water... I just saved the water until I need to do new water. Now my water is really weird. Um, I, do, I think I've only done an absorbency test on one of my pads, and I really didn't like it. I mean, it's okay, but, like, I really don't like it. Um... It's just a U by Kotex. No, this is just Kotex. Yeah, you'll find it, and then on the package it'll be like, Kotex is now U by Kotex. Which, that's how it's been for, like, ever, so. Um, we're just gonna start with 10 milliliters. Right? Oh. Or two teaspoons? 10 milliliters or two teaspoons? Okay. We're just going to see how this capture core... Oh, wow. That absorbs really fast. Like, look at that. It's barely even wet right there. See, this is an awesome pad. I don't really like Kotex or U by Kotex, but I like this pad. <laughs> is that weird? I do need to wash this. It's just stained, though. It's not, like, moldy gross. It's just stained. I swear. Promise. Um, I'm still sick. But, you know. Okay, this is what it looks like after 10 milliliters. And I'm sorry you can't see the top of the pad. I could have moved it back. Actually, I still can. Oh, but look at the back. That looks, that looks like it's maybe about to stop absorbing like the top layer doesn't look like that but the bottom layer does okay it's still absorbing super fast um you'd probably change it by now i would but it looks pretty dry for the most part like i can't give a full review because 
<sighs> My flow is really weird. That's almost completely dry right there. That's nearly completely dry on the spots that look dryish. I can't give like a complete view because my flow is really weird. Like it starts out medium, not light. No, no, no. Medium. Or I'm changing it maybe four times. And it gets really heavy. To where like almost every hour to two hours I have to change it. So, yeah. And then it gets like normalish. It's really weird. But it's a good pad. Maybe I just don't have pads that absorb a lot. You know. Okay, that's this is what it looked like after 20 milliliters. And you would most likely have changed it by now. Unless you're sleeping. You can't change it when you're sleeping. But I don't like to sleep with pads without wings when I sleep. Because I'm like scared. Because when I sleep sleep really weird and all of a sudden I'll just be like and then like the pad will move with your underwear I don't know it moves with the underwear normally but you know mm. guys I'm still looking for someone else to be on my channel I'm pro I want to pick at least two people but you have to sign up for me to pick at least two people um, I have one person that I'm going to pick um, and if you're watching yay but I'm not going to give her name, just in case she doesn't want to give her name. So, you know. Sorry, um, I messed up. Oh, this is what it looks like after 30 milliliters, by the way. It doesn't really, like, spread out. Like, it dries right there, then, and there. Um, but yeah, I'm looking for someone to be on my channel. I'll leave my kick in the description. Guys, specifically talking to guys that are watching these videos. I've been getting kicks from guys. Lots of kicks from guys. And girls, you get what I'm trying to say. Wow, these parts, um, those don't really absorb that much. They don't absorb unless you bleed, like, directly on them. And still, those dry pretty fast. Okay, this is 40 milliliters. I've seen a liner hold this much. That's sad. Let's just go until it leaks, okay? So this kind of proves it doesn't absorb this much because I've seen a liner absorb almost 60 before. It shouldn't be absorbed until almost 60, but it did, and it didn't leak. This would probably leak. And if someone from Dubai Cotex is watching, or Cotex, Better absorbencies. Now, I don't know if I got, like, a light pad. I don't think they have light pads, do they? I'm a newbie, okay? <sighs> Sorry, and I'm still sick. I just was like, I have to do a video today. I have to, I have to. So this is another 10 milliliters. Whoa, it's not absorbing as fast. Uh... <clears throat> Yeah. Oh, yeah. It's gonna leak. Whoa, why does it look blue over here? Okay. 50 milliliters, a leak. It leaked. It's leaking. It's dripping, in fact. Why does it look like that? Well, just let it drip. I'll clean it up. This is what it looks like after 50 milliliters. The sides started absorbing. 
it would not hold 50 milliliters at all. That was not going to happen. I've seen a liner absorb more than this. It shouldn't have absorbed more than this, and you shouldn't let it absorb more than this. But 10 milliliters, I mean, 50, 50, that's sad. <sighs> Obviously, you wouldn't bleed this much onto a pad before changing it, but it's sad. <laughs> Okay, that's what it looked like. It has this weird square thing inside of it. Um, not sure if I'd recommend this anymore. Because like I said, my flow was towards the end and it was really weird. Like, really light. Really light. Um, next time I'll use it when I'm heavy and see how much it absorbs. I'll might, I might do another absorbency test today. If I have enough t pads, I almost caught on tabs, um, because these I don't have that many of. I mean, I have a lot of these, so, yeah. I don't recommend these. Bye, guys. Um, my kick will be in the description. Guys, just seriously don't text me if you're a guy. Um, <laughs> I'm not trying to be rude or anything. But, unless you have questions, like, if you raise your sister, or if you raise, or, like, if, if your daughter, you know, if you're a single dad, and something might have happened to the mother, seriously, those are the only two exceptions. It's weird if guys watch my videos. Okay, bye guys, I really want you to be on my channel. You... Because then you can be on my channel. And I need more people on my channel. And obviously, I imagined my channel would have quite a few people because I named it those period girls. Sorry, I was stretching. But bye guys, join my channel, kick me. Tell me why you want to be on my channel. And then, there you go. Bye.